Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new to this channel, then make sure to click the subscribe button below just one step away so that you could get the latest updates and whatnot, guys. So moving on, as we already said a half an hour or one hour back before we said that uh, the I mean the auditor committee, I mean the audit committee chairman Uttam Prakash Agarwal has resigned from S Bank. And this news is been confirmed by S Bank board itself, guys. This is the official letter we saw from Bombay Stock Exchange listings. So they are given that they would like to intimate that it has received the resignation of Mr. Uttam Prakash Agarwal, an independent director and chairman of audit committee. So what is mean basically audit committee of a company that governs the overall functioning and administration and accounting process of a company for this business bank. So moving on now what they have said uh, he was appointed by the NRC. NRC means nomination and renomination committee of the board or the board of the bank both means same and today he has also given that the reason he is enclosed with this as you see here guys in this recognition letter as enclosed was made certain observations he had made certain observations that means that due to this reasons only he resigned from the bank so guys uh, it is duly uh, duly examined by the board means they have said that they will look forward for what the bank will do through the issues so moving on this is the official letter given by the Uttam Agarwal I mean the CA Uttam Agarwal is given this case as you can see here they are given that I hereby tender my resignation from the office of independent director of S Bank Limited so they have said that reasons for my resignation guys this is very very important point to note he has said that deteriorating standards of corporate governance failure of compliance ma management practices and manage the state of affairs of the company in a simple word that in which way the company is progressing is not good i mean it is conducted I mean the way by which md or nbg is conducted is not good and also the senior group president's governance and legal head and he is complaining on all regarding stating that uh, he is not good i mean the board of directors is not good uh, the ceo is not good he is selling guys and the main thing he has said is, he has said is that and millions of his small and large depositor investor stakeholders i have no stone unturned to discharge my duties this wrote a letter detailing all these matters in attached letter so what is happening currently in this company he has said that uh, the amount of fundraising that is done by I mean, the fund fundraising plan which is conducted by the bank is not proper he says so but the main point to note that there have been three meetings conducted till now I mean including today there has been a three meetings if it is not proper then why did that he give in first and second meeting is yes, guys why he should give in third meeting that is the point for me guys and corporate governance he is speaking Ranvi Gill was appointed one year back and this uh, person also appointed one year back so why did he say anything in this coming AGM or any half year results or any EGM why did he say? after a single word there was a marathon meeting for fundraising plan for love and hours as you know the first first meeting guys it was conducted that one that time why he didn't disclose these facts we don't know guys oh especially now he is discussing so that is a doubt we have and guys this is what we want to tell you and if you like this news then make sure you share to your friends and they can also know about this letter guys and we will leave a description in below therefore you could also go and read this statement and share this statement to your friends it will be helpful for you and don't forget to subscribe yourself for more videos like this and uh, see you in another video guys so soon